everybody. This is how we're, we're going to get, we're going to learn how to aim our bodies correctly so that we can hit good shots. First of all, when we get set up, okay, we're in good posture. I'm going to face you to do this. When we get set up, we're like this. And you can see that my hand, if I took the extension of this club and put it here, see where it's really pointing right now? And that's because I'm coming from underneath. And when I come from underneath, you can see the slight little rise that it causes in my left shoulder. Well, when I do that, it points my hand over in this direction. So what we do is we just make that little bump, which is our hip swiveling, that causes us to, to point everything in this direction. And when we do that, because we've already learned how to get set up in our posture correctly, right? So once we're set up in our posture correctly, now we have to make that little bump with our body to make sure that we have everything square, including the palm of the right hand. Now with the left hand too, it's like this. So I make the little bump like that. Now everything's square. Now I'm not gonna make a bump to where I'm pointing over here and the hand's pointing out there because that's exactly where it's gonna go. But if I get here and I'm like this, which is, if you think about it this way, the shoulder is pointing right at you, the right hand is right there, okay? So when the shoulder is here, you're gonna leave this joint here, this shoulder muscle there, and I'm just gonna move my hip like this. So when I get set up, watch the movement of the hip. We're set up like this, boom. Now my shoulder's kinda open, so watch my hip. It just swivels kinda like that right there. It just goes boom, just like this. I'm in a very athletic position. We already know that we're abducted, so we're here. Now I'm just gonna swivel the hip, boom. Just like that, put both hands on, look down, I'm on the club, I'm in the best position possible. So many people that play golf, they hit the ball to the right, okay? And the reason for that is simple. Again, if I get set up like this, okay? I'm right here, I'm gonna make my moves, and now they take, they reach across like this, they come back and they're like, okay, they don't make any little correctional bumps with the hips. They don't, they don't do anything that's necessary. So when they come through, everything's out of sequence and it pushes everything to the right. Okay, I mean, and again, believe it or not, a lot of that is a set up type of faulty uh, mechanism that's set up from the beginning. So if we get set up correctly, we're like this, and we just bump this, okay? And when we bump this like this, it puts everything parallel to the flight line of the golf ball. Now the second part of this, which is very, very critical, okay? Once I get set up, I'm in good posture, I know how I'm gonna grip the club, I know how I'm gonna get my abduction, but what I'm also gonna do is watch this little move I make with my hip. Boom, now everything is square. See that? I'm here. See how that just kind of sets me up real nice in everything that I've gotta do. Now the next little thing that I have to do Right now, you see a lot of players, they flip the club. Now you hear this, oh, don't flip the club as I come through. Well, the reason for that, believe it or not, it's not because you're doing something wrong. It's because you don't have your hands in the right place to start your golf swing. And that's all it comes out to. It's such a simple face. Everybody's seen that tour striker thing and you want to hit down on the golf ball and learn how to hit down on it. That's nonsense, okay? It's a gimmick. All right, but it, it, hey, it's a great product if you want to use it. We're not saying anything bad. We're just telling you it's a gimmicky club because you don't know how to set the club up properly. So we're going to teach you how to do that. Once you get here and you're set up and you've made your little moves, watch this. Here's my hand. I'm going to take my finger. I'm going to push my hand just like that. Now I'm going to grip the club. See how that shaft is leaning forward now? Oh my goodness, it's no longer straight up. It's now leaning forward. Because it's leaning forward at a dress, don't you think it has a really good chance of having that forward shaft lean and the butt in front of the, the club head to create the compression that's needed. Of course it is, okay? It's not some, hey, get here and you're gonna learn how to hit down on this ball. Let me tell you something, at 100 miles an hour, tour and above, or under 100 miles an hour, I don't care if you're 65 miles an hour, you try to control something at 65 miles an hour that's gonna teach you to hit down on it, good luck, okay? It doesn't work that way. But when you set this machine, which is us, the human body up correctly, now I'm here, I'm set up, I've made my little swivel, I'm gonna push this, and when I push this, the inside part of the butt of this club is coming to the inside part of my left hip socket, okay? And because of that relationship, watch this, I'm gonna get an impact, boom. There I am, it's still pointing at the left hip socket. See how the shaft is in front of me? Because this little pressing forward of my hand, it's not my arm, it's not my whole, everything going like this. It's just real simple, I'm set up, 
I'm abducted, I've come in from underneath, and I just take my finger, it's so simple, and I'm just gonna push my wrist forward. When I do that, look what it does to the club. Puts me right where I have to. So now as we go through the sequence of learning how to get geometrically optimized, you understand that this, because I preset it one way, just makes things happen correctly. So again, let's remember, first of all, we get set up. We get aimed correctly by swiveling our hips like this. So again, I'll show you from here, the right palm, is now facing because my right arm is getting lower than my left. And because of that, I'm trying to look at my target. So instead of looking at my target like this, I'm here and now I'm gonna make my head turn on a wheel like this. This way and that way. This way, here's my line. This way and that way. I'm not going like this. I'm not coming up like this and I'm damn sure not going like that. So I'm here, I'm gonna track my eyes down my line here down my line. And when I look down my line, I'm like, oh, okay, my head's down my line, my shoulder's down my line. I'll be damn, my hand's pointing over to the left. How is that possible? Well, it's just the way that we're built. It's real simple. We're just gonna make an adjustment. Boom. Head still hasn't moved. It's right down the line. It's striking right down the line of the shaft. Now I come here, everything's good. Now I make my last little move, bump the wrist forward, and I'm ready to go. It's really that simple. If you have any problems with any of this, send us an email. We'll be glad to help you out.